YouTube, what is up? Today we're going to be doing Pick'ems. Week 3, we are currently on in Pacific. Top, what, 13% at the moment, top 12%. We're doing okay last week. I got wrecked a little bit. First week, great. Last week, not so much. Week 3, Talon against DFM. I'm going to go with Talon. I talked about um, this on Plat Chat. We got Zeta against RRQ. I think RRQ should be so fine here. If Zeta don't ban Icebox, I just feel like RRQ is going to be a map ahead. Then we got T1 against Global. And I said on Plat Chat I was going to go for T1. So I'm going to stick with that. But I can see Global upsetting here. But um, T T1, I think it's like a nothing to lose situation anymore. Pressure's off. I think they'll just be fragging out. Gen G against Bleed, I don't need to explain this one too much. Paper X against DFM, I think that's the same kind of storyline here. And then DRX Talon. Ooh, DRX Talon. I'm gonna go with DRX on this. As much as Sideshow was flaming them heavy, I didn't think they looked as bad as he fought, even though I think they didn't... I mean, I, even though I think they look kind of bad. Um... But I think we're starting to see the first signs of, uh, I mean, kicking an IGL. We sort of EDG, EDG as well. You lose an IGL, it um, it messes stuff up, especially in the short term. Um, okay, so let's uh, move on to Americas. How are we doing on Americas? Oh, it's super weak. Oh, there's a lot of these. All right, super weak. EG against Furia. I'm going with EG. Sentinels against Crew. Sentinels against crew, we're going with Sentinels. Loud MIBR, I have Loud for this one. Do I need to explain any of these? Okay, I'll, I'll quick. I'll do quick explanations. Evil Genius against Furia, I need to see Furia look that good two times in a row. Crew, Sentinels is going to be a lot closer than we think, but the amount of protocol stuff that Sentinels had on their new comp on Lotus really impressed me. I think they've been working hard. Zekken, Tens, both looking outrageous. So I'm just confident in them to be able to take this. As much as I think this will be cr close and crew probably takes them up. Loud MIBR, I just think that Loud didn't look that bad against EG. I just felt that EG, this uh, new meta suits them pretty heavy. And they're heavy leaning into the new meta. Um, Lev against 100 Thieves. Going with 100 Thieves, but I think this should be pretty close. Do I feel... Yeah, okay, I'm going to stick with 100 Thieves here, but I'm actually not too confident about this. I think uh, they're starting to get burnt out. I think they're in the same spot that Sentinels were in after Masters Madrid, just without the win, obviously. And, yeah, I think they're just a little bit behind on the meta, and maybe they don't have that extra time that all the other teams had. NRG against G2. This is the big one. I spoke about this on Plat Chat as well. I'm, a, I'm an NRG believer after what I saw on Sunset. Lotus, I think... Sentinels just had a new comp. It's hard to deal on the fly. And against G2, that in theory won't have too much new stuff. I think NRG, with all the demos, should be okay. That's why I'm leaning to them here. I think G2 are the favorites. Um, and if you look at... I mean, G2 should be the favorites, but I've just taken a bit of a punt on NRG. From what I've seen historically, from them being out to anti-strat teams with a lot of demos, and uh, just what I saw in Sunset. I hope they sort out their defense. I will say that as well in terms of NRG. Um, Sentinels against Cloud9. I'm going to back Sentinels again. I think Sentinels... Did Cloud9 only have to play one game this week? Ooh. Okay, I'm sticking with Sentinels, but that is a factor that people should be thinking about. Um, so yeah, maybe there's an upset potential here. That maybe makes Crew have more chance as well. Um, Lev against EG. I'm going to stick with EG on this one. Is that right? Do I see Lev losing twice? Yeah, I'm fine with that. Loud Furia, I'm going to back Loud again. And if obviously if Furia win this, I would probably pick Furia here. But um, yeah, I need to see again. I need to see the double the double back-to-back -back from Furia. It might be our 100 Thieves. I think that one's relatively easy. And then NRG Crew, I'm on board with the NRG trainer. I kind of think they can do it. So I've, I've got to I've got to back that. I've got to have some belief in them. Um, it, it definitely is a punt. They definitely are the underdogs for both teams. I just believe they can do it. And yeah, I'm going to go down as a believer. So that is America's. And last we have EMEA. And 
this week. I mean, we still get games to play this week. I could still make a recovery here. There was a lot of upsets. Like, me, the Fnatic Vitality, and not saying that was an upset, but uh, I wasn't expecting it to look this dominant from Fnatic. And then Giants beating Na'Vi. Na'Vi, I <laughs> don't know what's going on with Na'Vi at the moment. And then Koi Giants really surprised me as well with Koi taking that. Team Heretics, that's all I need to see. I don't need to see who they're playing against because that's all that matters. We got Foot against Gentlemates. Similar story, to be honest. Um, Na'Vi, Na'Vi against Koi. Oh, no. Chat. I can't. I can't pick Koi, can I? Na'Vi looks so bad. Um... I think it's so hard to just... I should I should click Koi and have recency bias here. But it's so hard for me to look at this lineup and just see them losing it. Okay, I'm not going to learn my lesson. I'm going to stick with Na'Vi. I think I come back to regret this. They can't look this bad. I, d I don't know if Doom Bros was doing literally everything in the team, but it everything looks off. Vibes, the... Discipline from some of the anti-ecos. Some of the decisions that are being made. Individually, they're all trying to do stuff on their own. It, it looks so different. It, it's kind of wild. Um, Liquid against K-Corp. After what I've seen, I have to still go with K-Corp here. Um, yeah, it's been a bit of a disaster for Liquid on some of their games. Um, Vitality against BBL. I think I'm still believing... Am I still believing in the safe duelist? BBL will look pretty legit today. I might take a punt on BBL here. Yeah, let me do that. I think just with how good BBL looked, and maybe it was inflated from Liquid, but I think I'm going to go with BBL for that one. Um, and then, again, Heretics are here, so I have to go with Heretics. I also messed up my Chinese pickums by doing them too late. So it's another week. I think I just have to accept that my Chinese pickums are done. Apologies for people that wanted to see them. Um, and yeah, I think that is it. I think we got everything there. Thank you for the likes, the subs. And if you, what's the big game? What's the big game here? G2 NRG. Who have you looked off for that? That's like one of the big games, right? Who do you have winning out of G2 NRG? Am I mental for picking energy? Let me know in the comments. Thank you so much, everyone. I'll see you on the next video. Peace, peace, peace.